Hey there everybody, Mr. Liquid Matter here. Just uh, getting a lot of questions uh, regarding, you know, how do you record your videos, what recording software do you use, um, how do I get the texture packs, where do I find the music that you use, uh, what do you render in, what, uh, what are you recording in. Um, lots of lots of good questions and there are a lot of them are being repeated. So figured want to make a video for everyone so you can see uh, what it is exactly I'm doing, what kind of hardware I have in order to record Minecraft the way I do. Um, something I was trying to point out in the last video, I don't know if you guys saw it. You can actually, this texture pack's done really well. Um, you can see the heat on the uh, lava. And then uh, I like the water a lot. Um, got a nice kind of a smooth flow to it. Got a lot of a kind of a, it's got a crystal, uh, crystal look to it. Across the way there, it's really nice. So we're going to take a look at some of the hardware here. As you can see in the uh, top left corner, um, I have an AMD Phenom uh, 2 Quad um, 830. That's a 2.8 gigahertz uh, quad core, um, 6 gigabytes of RAM, 64-bit operating system, obviously. It's going to be running 32-bit, so it doesn't matter. Um, my graphics card, that's really where it's separated. Um, I'm using a NVIDIA GeForce GTX 460, uh, 1 gigabyte uh, GDDR5 um, onboard memory. And something that really separates uh, me from the competition um, is the solid state 2 terabyte drive. The solid state 2 terabyte drive, that's where you're going to be storing your recorded Minecraft video um, because it is so insanely fast. Um, you can record at a much higher frame rate, um, greater quality um, as you go, and it's not going to stumble and trip over itself. And also, I can run my fraps on another drive, that way I have um, a greater frame rate when recording. You know, something else that may be beneficial to you is uh, your graphic settings. Obviously, everyone knows the better the graphics are, the slower your frame rate's going to be. When it comes to recording videos, frame rate is key along with quality. Go to your video settings. What's really going to affect it the most is your smooth lighting. If you're using 3D Anaglyph, you know, if you're not, leave it off. Render distance, everyone knows. Uh, bring your rest render distance to shorter if you're struggling with frame rate. In this case, I can be on, smooth lighting on. Um, graphics fancy, again, um, if you don't have um, a graphics card that can run all three of these, you know, go ahead and switch over to fast. Um, view bobbing off, that one also affects your frame rate a little bit. Uh, limit frame rate, I would never limit my frame rate. I want to be as high as possible at some points of the game. It kind of It kind of jumps on and off. Um, but in some cases it's, you know, oh, that felt good. In some cases it's totally fine. Um, but that's pretty much it. A lot of people are going to say, oh, recording your audio is going to make a big difference. No, it's not going to make a big difference in your, uh, in your game. That's really no problem. Um, something about Fraps 3.4 that was released, uh, about a week ago from me making this video, uh, is that it was specifically tailored more for, uh, recording Minecraft, um, uh, in particular in HD, um, they fixed a couple bugs with the recording in the regular default window size, um, but they've also worked uh, on improving um, the HD quality and the HD frame rate. So right now, um, doo -doo 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 -doo. let's see if you can see that. Um, that's full 1080 HD, 1080p HD, um, 25, 26, 20. The reason it's dropping so rapidly is because it's nighttime out and I'm running a uh, 256 texture pack. Um, this is 256, even though you know, a lot of people are going to say it's 16. This is a 256. The water's 256. It's the default texture pack added to a 256. Um, so the the frame rate drops with the with the more labor intensive texture pack they're going to be using, such as this one, because it is drawing um, these animations pixel by pixel. As you can see, you know it's still fairly smooth, um, but it is drawing. The, uh, the animations pixel by pixel. So, um, just kind of... What? Does anyone know what these numbers are? They're so dumb! Although it kind of helps you find the squid if you need to get ink. Or slimes. If you're underground, you can helps you find slimes a little bit. But yeah, uh, texture pack's another one. Uh, plays a huge factor. Um, the default texture pack's definitely the way to go if you're going to focus on frame rate. And I know a lot of people seem to struggle with that. All right, another tactic that might uh, work for a lot of uh, uh, middle-class computers is uh, separating the cores. I've seen it. I've tried it. It kind of worked for me. 
you can try it out, see what works for you. Um, open your task manager here, find your Java, because that is your Minecraft. Uh, right click on the Java, um, set affinity, and then uh, you have your selection of processors here. Make sure that your uh, Minecraft is not running on the same processors as your fraps now it doesn't matter to me because fraps actually utilizes the gpu uh, more than the cpu um, so to me it really doesn't matter if you have a lower end computer and uh, you can get fraps to, uh, and your fraps is using more of your cpu than your gpu then this would be beneficial to you and then um, then you would find fraps by hitting f and there's my fraps and then i would do the same for that and that's not good and uh, and you can uh, set it on the other two processors and have it record. Just make sure they're not on the same processors. Uh, that way it can uh, dedicate uh, its own processing um, because it is so intense with the, the quality that it's drawing from Minecraft. Uh, so that may actually work out pretty well for you as well. And one more thing I wanted to mention. A lot of you, most of you are asking... Uh, Mr. Mr. Liquid Matter, where are you getting your music from? This is where I get it. A uh, gentleman by the name of Lap Fox. It's on Bandcamp. I will leave a link to uh, the uh, the Bandcamp below. Uh, I've put out over 100 Minecraft videos in the past uh, couple months, um, and I would say 99 out of 100 of the videos, um, the music's come from Lap Fox. I've paid for what I've downloaded. Um, I've donated a lot of money as well. The music's good it's worth the price and there isn't a price tag on most of it it's just uh you know pay whatever you want it just says hey you know if you can get all 12 songs for a dollar but i'll i'll, I'll pay him ten dollars because it's good music it really is so i recommend you uh you check it out um if you have any questions please leave them below um this is where i will be answering them and of course rate comment and subscribe thanks folks